There's a whole universe of activity occurring in this patch of milkweed. The milkweed tussock caterpillar is often discovered during September and October on the underside of the leaves. The caterpillar does not enjoy the sticky latex compound that's associated with the milkweed plant. In a feat of amazing ingenuity, mature caterpillars often sever the vein before feeding on the leaf, thus reducing the flow of latex into the leaf and keeping itself clean from the sticky milk. The tussock family includes most caterpillars that have densely packed long hairs on their body. The milkweed tussock is easy to identify with its black and orange hairs, with long white ones near its anterior and posterior ends. Milkweed tussocks are often found in groups, all feeding on the same plants. They tend to prefer mature milkweed as opposed to fresh growth. As they feed, they absorb toxins from the plant into their bodies. The toxins are carried over to the adult moth stage, giving them a foul taste to bats and other predators. They'll overwinter inside a cocoon and hatch as a moth next spring. It's always humbling to imagine this tiny caterpillar weathering winter's icy temperatures. Although the milkweed tussock is not camouflaged compared to its host plant, they're often difficult to see. Their odd appearance can be mistaken for the following. A dead leaf, a bird dropping, or even a glob of wet milkweed seeds.